Nicky, a good two wins. Is that the same message you want to carry to going on to Saturday? Yeah, at the minute it's um, it's just a good start and that's, that's all it is at the minute. Um, we'll take each game as it comes. Each game presents a different challenge, I suppose. Um, Mid and Ed will be probably pretty similar to, to the way Chesterfield play, quite direct and it'll be a tough game for, for different reasons. Last night, first half probably didn't go to plan, especially when they got their goal going in the second half, but to come back, does it really show the character of the squad that we've got this year? Yeah, in terms of didn't go to plan, um, we probably didn't Im implement our game plan on them as much, but um, the general feeling for me in the game was, was still pretty comfortable first half, although we had to defend a few a few set pieces and a few long throws, it, it still felt pretty comfortable and I, I don't really remember them creating too many chances. How impressed have you been, um, you know, as one of the more experienced uh, lads in the squad with uh, the new players coming in, especially the young lads like Cass getting thrown straight in and doing such a good job in these first two games? Yeah, they've, they've been brilliant, like, um, it's totally different football to what to what some of them are used to, like, um, the 23s football's quite nice and not many tackles go on and it, it's a type of a type of football that probably only sets you up for, for top level football um, so for them to come into the National League where it is a bit more like men's football the contact there, the physicality side of it is, is totally different to what they used to so yeah they've dealt with it very very well. Personally for yourself on your game you know, the Hartlepool fans are absolutely raving about you especially the last few seasons about how I mean, you look like as you get older, you're improving more and more. You know, is there anything you've changed to your game to keep that consistent level of performance? Um, probably got a manager now that that trusts me. Um, not that I didn't have that previously, but I, f I feel very comfortable in the in the way you want to play and and the style in, in which we want to play. Um, I had injuries in the past, which I probably shouldn't have played certain games and that. I'm injury free now, I'm, I'm fit, diet's probably better. Um, so yeah, just, I suppose you learn a few things the older you get, so yeah. Do we expect to be top scoring or you're on penalties, aren't you? Definitely not. I hope someone's, someone's scoring more goals than me this season, <laughs> if we want to be where we are. Is that, so does that mean you're on free kicks as well, hoping to see a few long oh, I've not been, Free kicks haven't been mentioned, mate, no. Just no. penalties. I'll just take penalties, yeah. What was the gaffer's message at half time yes, yesterday? Obviously, you did go in nil nil. It kind of looked like we were getting dragged into Chest Chesterfield's game a little bit. What did he say going in at half time? Uh, yeah, there was there was a few words being exchanged. Like, um, well, not exchanged, just just the gaffer going off on one. Um, he just didn't didn't feel like we uh, implemented our game plan on on them, and it it was a game that or a half that pretty much suited Chesterfield um, and the style in which they want to play. Um, he just said it, in this league, sometimes you're going you're gonna to have to mix things up. Uh, teams aren't going to allow us to, to play football all the time. And I think he was happy with the way we responded second half, where we matched them um, physically as well. and Just not to allow teams to bully us. Like. Going into Saturday, in head I've lost the first two games. We've won our first two games. Is anyone in the squad getting a little bit carried away yet or not? No, definitely not. Like I said earlier, it's just a good start at the minute. We'll take each game as it comes and each challenge as it comes. Um, it'll still be a tough game on, on Saturday. Um, but we said it's probably the best time to play Maiden Ed with the pitch. The pitch will be OK at the minute. Um, we've played there when the pitch has been, been poor. And, and it's made a difference, so it's probably a good time for us to go there. Thank you, thanks very much.